Welcome to the E107 video tutorials. In this video tutorial I'm going to show you how to create a menu and also put it into an area and you can see that I've highlighted the areas that I want to put it into. So there's one on the front page and there's also another one on the internal pages. So firstly you'll need to log into the admin area and of course you can type that in the URL or you can go to the link at the bottom of the page as you can see there. Firstly we want to create a menu so we want to go to custom menus and pages. If you've already got a menu set up it'll show up in here but we want to create one so we're going to create menu on the right hand side and we're going to give it a title. That's the menu name to show you uh, what the, uh, the menu is and then also that's the title and caption that will show up on the front of the website. We're also going to put some text in here and we're going to go create menu. Okay so now you can see that there is a title test menu and a menu type there. So now we need to assign that to an area and we need to do that by going to content menus and this will show you the front display and there's also like uh, the pages that you'll have them set up. So there's one for home and if I click on that it'll show me the area that I want to assign it to and then also if I go back to default it'll show me the one at the bottom there. So we're going to start off by assigning one to the home page and you'll see that there's the test menu that we set up so I'm going to click that and I'm going to click activate in area 2 and you can see that there by area 2 okay and to see that actually on the real website click leave admin I'm just going to open a new tab and show you and you can see that that test title is now in there if we wanted to deactivate that title we go back to that menu area and we click the drop down and we go deactivate you can put multiple menus in there so I'm going to put that back and then I'm also going to put in another menu that might have been previously set up or the default ones that are um, already in the system and go area 2 and you'll see that there's now two menus if I go back to the front page and I reload you'll see that there's two menus there now okay I am going to move one of them to area 1 and that's in the other page so if I change the layout you'll now see that that is in area 1 and if I go to an internal page you'll see that that menu has moved and I can also do the same to the other one as well I'm going to move that to area 1 as well course if you want to not have them there anymore you can go to that menu block and go deactivate and that will turn them off okay so if you want some options on this title or this menu so I'll activate it in area 2 you can actually make it visible to only certain users and only on certain pages so if we go to visibility and this will be a bit hard to read but it gives you some options to make, the visi make it visible to only certain people so you might want to make it only visible to members only or to nobody and there's some other options in there as well but most of the time it will be set to public and then you can also make it visible only to certain pages so or hidden to certain pages so I'm going to make sure that it only is visible to a particular page and that's going to be this page here and of course if that menu isn't on that page it won't show up at all um, and there's some more explanation of how it all works save that so now there'll be a red star next to that menu stating that there is some visibility options assigned to it 
and if I go back to the front page of course that menu doesn't display because I'm on page.php not stats.php and because that menu isn't assigned there it won't display either so that's the basics of how the menu system works for E107